everyone, it's me again, um, and today I'm going to be bringing you some more gameplay. Uh, today is going to be Infested Planet. It's um, actually in its beta stage at the moment. You can pre-order, I'll give you the links, etc. down below. It's currently on deal, um, so uh, get in there quick. Uh, it's doing, I think it's probably just doing this whole model of you can, you get, you get to, you pre-purchase and you get into the beta. So, um, what is it? It's 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 pretty cool so far. I can't actually tell you all that much because I'm not entirely sure what it is myself. It seems like a mixture between um, oh I don't know, tower defense and strategy. It's similar to tanks. Uh, oh what was what was it called? It was it was uh, you know it was a, it was a couple of future games. I've completely forgotten the names. Um, where where you had to kind of combine tower defense and and uh, unit creation are uh, fairly recently released, but uh, it's, uh, you, you're basically controlling a squad of five guys who can be upgraded um, depending on the map in terms of what you can gear, and you're facing off against a huge, huge amount of aliens. It's actually it, re it reminds me a lot in terms of the feel um, and the general missions that is taking quite a lot of from uh, Starship Troopers and that sort of franchise, and I love that, and I love that franchise and. <laughs> um, so it, that's, it's, uh, it's got all the benefits there for me and I'm enjoying that. So I've actually played a f good few missions so hopefully I'm not going to completely suck and you'll see me succeed in this one. Some of them have been quite difficult I have to admit so um, I think the best explanation is just to, go, to do the gameplay and show you the gameplay and just get, it, get in. Um, I look out and you'll be receiving your briefings from me now, cool. The army is mobilizing for a big push into the cave system <laughs> and you're going to be in the front of that attack, oh glorious. General Magdusun, and I have decided to use the Devils as a recon team. I'm guessing we're the Devils. So you'll be the first to see what the aliens have for us. Report to the front at 0900. That's 9 o'clock for you civilians. Cool. Right, so. Straight away, you'll notice that um, it's in 2D. And in terms of colors and aesthetics, it's actually very, very similar to some... To, uh, it reminds me, actually, even though it's, it's got less graphics, it reminds me of zombie, that zombie game, what's it, I can't remember what it's called. Oh, wow, my memory's bad. Please, please forgive me, today is a uh, very hangover intensive day after my 21st birthday. So, there we go. Hello. I can train a fusion shotgun and rifles. Wow. Cool. I could train him to be a shotgun. There we go, look at that, he's a fusion shotgun. Can't really complain about that. Now, up here you can see these build points, and that's actually things that you need to use. Now, because I'm going to be having to go through here, I'm honestly not sure. I think I'm going to build a turret here. Just protect this first base. You can recycle things, so... It'll be a good place to start off with. There's a huge amount of enemies here, so I'm actually going to end up... I think I'm going to just train another one just so we can start moving these guys up. So let's move my shotgun guys up so you can use direct control over this squad. Um, I'm guessing these are walls. So, uh, yeah, hopefully we'll be fine. In terms of these guys, I'm not too worried. You just need to defeat them as they come closer. And I, as I move up, I'll be able to just take them out. Um, my guys can only <laughs> fire when they're stopped moving, so I probably was a little too close to them. I'm not sure if he took a hit. No, he didn't take any damage. We're all full health across the board, which is fine. Um, now, these things, these hives, I think is probably the best way of uh, describing them, are basically these things here, and they're just kind of your, your, your terrain capture places. No, I'm not entirely sure how you meant to. This. I think you actually. I'll have to. Oh no! You can fire, it, destroy them. It looks like some sort of shielding. That's fair enough. Oh dear! We've attracted the attention of this hive, and you can start to see <laughs> the crazy amounts of uh, units they have. I mean, look at it. It's, it's just. It's ridiculous. Now well, these things give me ammunition. I've currently got full ammunition, so I can start chucking grenades in and taking large. Uh, you can only shoot. At buildings, you can't just randomly shoot these, so I can shoot at this stuff here if I wanted to. Um, I don't, so yeah, let's put you here. So you just there we go. Look at that. Oh, these fusion guys are very powerful, I have to admit. I'm liking this. 
And this first base should be fairly easy, actually, because it's just a... Uh, it's just uh, a birthing place. So it's just going to con con continue just spawning thousands and thousands of these guys. It's these bases I need to worry about, because it's got these tower defense things. And you need to try and take them out with grenades. I think that's the, that's the only way I've been... Uh, reliably taking them out so far because they poison your men and they do a lot of damage and it's not all that fun. Uh, it's a bit, it's a bit nasty. If these guys are, look like they're dying, I'm gonna, I'll, I can recycle them so they just become normal uh, machine guns again. So there, I get those, get those build points back. Are you gonna take those? Yeah, cool. So yeah, each individual alien is just getting killed. I love that. I just like this. Anyway, let's just go ahead and. If I left click on that and left click on assault that, they're actually going to start moving on to the point where they can damage it. And if I'd done that from further away, they would have just come up. So I'll, I'll show you that technique on uh, this one, I think. Because that gun should be able to defend from this space here, so I think that should be alright. I'm just going to make them capture this place. I'll put another cannon in here, I think. Ah, there we are. So I'm just going to capture it. Then... I'm going to build a turret just here, hopefully, and it can protect against the assaults coming from this base because it, it should be able to just handle it completely fine. There we go. In which case, I can start taking my squad this way, and I'm gonna—I don't want to recycle any. I already have—I have a turret there, completely fine. I got two turrets down. I don't want to recycle my shotgun. I've got plenty. Ugh, fine. Fine. I will recycle that one as well. And I'll build a turret here. Because the game wants me to. So you have to do what the game says. Or the game gets angry. <laughs> In which case, I'm actually going to recycle this turret as well. No, I can't. Because they're just going to go straight down here. Yeah, I like this because it's meant to be some sort of invasion of the planet, so you get proper, you get your helicopter support as well. Um, yeah, let's just send them to attack. So obviously these bugs can cross through these protections, whereas my guys can't. I'm just gonna left click there and tell them to assault. Doesn't look like it has any turrets or anything, so we should be fine. So they're gonna automatically start moving up and being smart themselves. Okay, just so I can have two shotgun guys because they're really powerful. Uh, this turret looks like it's going to be completely fine. It's just going to hold them off and not let any of them get past this point. Um, it looks like it is. I'll have to rush back and give it some help. Hello! That gives me a lot of metal. So if I go back over there I'll be able to take it out. But I kind of want to take out this place first. Um, this is going to be the. This is really difficult because it's got these turrets and they're actually really quite hard to do. Hello, that's. So they're all sending their aliens down this way, and I'm not sure if that turret's going to be. Well, we, we can hope. So these guys are doing fairly well so far. They're moving up slowly. I love. This is the the, the real Starship Troopers moments, aren't they? These these units just taking them out. Obviously, everything is always. Oh, hello. They're going to try and capture this point because that's was placed so far away. Yeah, my turret was there. It would have helped this turret, and it would have stopped these guys from taking it. That's what's annoying me, is because the game told me I had to put it there. You know, I'm going to do the smart thing. Bring my guys back. Let's uh, have you assault back off. And, you know, I'm just going to recycle this turret when they get close enough. What? And it, well, yeah, it better let me build another one and put it here. That's ammo. You grab that. You two, come over here. You come over here. And you come over here. Okay, cool. He's been upgraded. I have no idea what he's been upgraded to. Um. Oh, he's a healer. Oh, hello. This is going to be a useful unit. He's got the long range. He's gonna. I think he's gonna be able to. Look at that. That's per that's gonna make this entire level a whole lot easier. Um, right. That's fine. 
That means this side is completely fine because of that turret being there. So that turret will just hold down that corner. Put these guys here. I'm gonna recycle this baby. And I'm gonna replace it over here. Um yes. Yeah, so it'll do there. Cause that means it can cover this area. This is useful having this guy here. Wow, I like this. It's a good guy to have upgraded. What is this guy meant to be? A medic. And you know, these medics also have a long range thing. Oh, that seems like a bit of an overpowered unit. So, because of this, I can now we can start again and assault this place because we've got this still held down. Because <laughs> now that turret's been reproduced and uh, replaced. Oh, sorry, I was about to sneeze. So, um, and good, the AI is to the point where the medic is going to stay behind the squad. So I'm like, oh wow, this is fun. <laughs> I would prefer the graphics to be better. But you know what? You can't have everything you want. <laughs> <clears throat> also, what I would like is to, you know, you know, all the other game, um, natural selection. I would like if there was a co-op version of that, which is very similar to this. So you had a commander, and you have your team of maybe even up to 32 players with a, a huge map, and you actually have to send your guys out and capture the points and a ton of AI. Um, Aliens are spawning in, you have to control your squads and see if one person's kind of got this perspective while the rest have they play in the first person. I think that's a fantastic thing. All these marines playing together, kind of space marines, you know, that'd be fantastic. Whereas in reality, a lot of a lot of that doesn't happen. Um, I don't, I, it's a bit too arcadey as it is at the moment. And there's a lot going for co op, especially when you've got a load of friends together to play. I mean, it's, it's, it's a great fun. I kind of in my heart of hearts. I'm, I'm hoping for a, a bit. Wow, that medic is so powerful. You see, he just lit up an entire. Ugh. Go on, keep assaulting. Get you to assault up there. Um, but yes, I'm in my heart of hearts. I'm, I'm hoping for um eventually seeing a reincur some sort of Starship Troopers first person strategy co-op thing. Um, so you can maybe have a proper, you know, plenty of guys. Okay, right, so we've got more BPs. And it's probably going to be worth my while to put turret down. Although, none of these places seems... Yeah, so I think it would be smart to put turret down here. Um, didn't mean that. Let's click on that. Let's put turret here. Ah oh dear. So that one's going to. See, this is going to be the difficulties because they're managing. Hmm. It's annoying. Right, off we go. We're going to come over here and we're going to stop this lot over here. And then we're going to replace this turret to guard against up going up there. So the walls can be destroyed slowly. Ah yes, so they've taken the place, so the hives are going to react and start sending guys down here. So that turret may not actually be the best position because it's going to have to deal with two of them. However, I think I'm going to be able to... Put, no, okay, grand. I'm going to have to quickly do this then. Let's go ahead and assault this place here. Frustrating. Oh dear, see that's them attacking me. Um... I'm gonna be. I'm gonna, just gonna do the smart thing. Have them be healed by the medic being close to them. Just have them in a line here. Um, let's recycle this baby and send one of my guys over to build a turret here. Uh, yes. Actually, yeah, I'm going to recycle you, and one of you is going to build me a turret here. Um, yeah, so let's keep you here for now, actually. Actually, well, yeah, we probably should deal with this lot here. You can build that in time. 
Possibly. Yes, I think you are. It's a lot of them coming down. Oh dear, they're taking this place now. Let's get you up here. So this is all five of me here, so I'm gonna go in. Let's go ahead and assault here. Very frustrating. Very frustrating. I think that's either a three or an eight. I can't really see because of. Can I forward one? No. Cool. How much do they cost? Seven. This is probably three then. Um, we got the fraps. <laughs> well, not fraps, but recording software. Uh, FPS up there. Okay, alright, so they've assaulted there. Um, I'm actually going to go ahead and have them move in a line here so my medic will, will be able to fire long range and take out these tar turrets. You're going to take out the turrets? Yeah, that's nice. Nah, wait, what? You're not gonna be, it's not actually taking them out. That's annoying. Because it's not taking them out. That's me getting some ammo. You just have to kind of deal with it at the moment. You're best off using these. I'm pulling this guy back to grab the ammo so they can actually use these grenades to take out those turrets. Uh, it's going to be interesting to see how much of these... Okay, grand, I think we've managed to do it. Fine. Uh, you are normal, aren't you? There we go. And that's build points down. So, recycle you because we don't need you there anymore. And I've got plenty of build points, so I'm going to go ahead, I'm going to place a turret here. And to be honest, I don't think I really need, need him anymore. You, you normal, you're a rifle. Let's train you up to be fusion shotgun. Let's train you up to be fusion shotgun. Just so my men are really powerful. And let's go ahead and have you... Hmm, it's going to be annoying to assault because I'll have to do them all at the same time. So I'm tempted to go with this side and attack this side first. So that's fine. That just means we can uh, build a second tower here. And the two of those towers should be able to hold off all of this by themselves. I'm hoping, because that is quite a lot of them. I'm hoping the two of them will be able to take him out. So let's go ahead and bring... Actually, we'll get some ammo. Ammo full. Okay. Well, we've wasted that. Never mind. Um, it's probably the best way. best way is probably just coming up and taking out this area and getting some of these build points, I think. Probably. I've not, I've not actually lost a single guy. I think it's because of this medic being awesome. I need to sniff. I need to sniff. Ugh, at least I'm not feeling as rough as I was earlier. Right, you can take out that guy. Let's go ahead and tell you to assault the main base. There we go. Oh, right, they've got... These are eggs. These are eggs that have... Um, wow. Wow spawn points within them, that's that's cheating. It's very much cheating. This way they actually get healed by the medic being behind them. So I can just tell them to assault and they should be able to destroy them on their way. And I'm not actually too much worried about you having to use these um the the grenades on the turrets because as you can see even though they're getting poisoned and damaged, the medic is the point where he's healing them so he's he's really not too worried. And these shotgun guys, like they're doing tons of damage. Okay, so we've managed to do fairly well so far. Um, you're being outflanked though, which I don't like. <laughs> He's very powerful. Come starship troopers, look to your left. You want to live forever? And all other other quotes from with American voices. So these turrets are really it's a bit of bloody slaughter in the middle of there, isn't it? Um, 
I think we're okay. Come on, guys. Let's go ahead and position you in the middle there. There we go. And you can feel free to take out those places. Right, these are. I need to tow these crates in. Oh, good. I don't even have to individually select them. They're all just gonna go grab them. So once they've grabbed them, I'm gonna then tow them all back here. So all five of them are gonna bring the crates back in. Zip, 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 and a ton of build points is mine to play with. This place is just spawning hundreds and hundreds of these things, isn't it? Okay, well in which case, I think we're gonna go up and we're going to go ahead and build a turret here. And a turret there. And that's and actually I'm gonna do the main assault up through this way. I think this is the best probably the best way to do it. There we go. Oh hello, he's getting He got hit by everything, didn't he? Oops. Okay, come on you guys. Let's go this way. Cause that turret's gonna hold down that area. Perfectly fine. Um let's go ahead and recycle that turret. And then we'll build another one. Uh, here I guess. That means two turrets are gonna hold, being able to hold that one down perfectly fine. And those two turrets should hold off that point. So it's not too difficult so far. Some of the times have been harder. The mission before this was hard because they didn't have this healer. So when I was telling them to assault places, they were just, you know, being slaughtered on the way. Right, so they're gonna start moving up, doing their, uh, doing their star their starship trooper goodness. So we're gonna take out the aliens on their way. Look at that, I love this, this is so cool. Look at that. Starting to take some damage from these towers. But they also get healed at the same time. Come on, take them out. Take them out. See, they are, they are probably the most powerful enemy unit. Because they have a bit of range. You have to get within shooting distance before you're gonna damage them. So this last horde here is gonna be the last guys to come over and get taken out by the cannons. That's fine though. There we go, there we are, taking out the enemy base very, very quickly, very easily, because the main aliens uh, force is coming to the left over here. So we should be able to just pop in here and take them out. Capture this point. Maybe plonk a turret down. Right in the center. Um, is it going to give me any build points here? I think I'm going to be able to f maybe afford... We'll see. You build that right there. Keep it in the center. Let's go ahead and recycle these. Uh, actually, no, we'll leave one there. I'm going to put another one down. Over there. And you can start taking out all these guys. They could probably destroy the turret, so... Uh, wow. <laughs> we need to start being a bit tougher on where I'm placing my units, being a bit more aggressive. I think I'm going to actually send my squad to the left here so they can take out these spawning points. Let's get you to assault down here. Let's get you to assault that place. Come on, guys. Start moving. So those turrets look like they're doing fairly well. Weakening it all. And I'm quite glad I left that one, because obviously there are some that are getting through. You catch up with them. Catch up with them. Here we go. Right. Uh, left first, I guess. Because they're on the left. That's a lot of turrets there. I'm actually I'm tempted to uh, let's just say, let's grenade this one, this one here. Because there's a lot of turrets in very close proximity. That worked. Didn't take too much damage to begin with. Take out that turret, please, people. So the sort of shotguns are powerful, but they're just not all that accurate. Which is fine. It seems like we're holding them off fairly well on all sides. Um, let's go ahead and recycle you. And rebuild a turret. And let's place it here, just so you can help us. Right in the front. It doesn't take long to place down. There we go. 
And when we actually finally assault this final objective, we're going to be able to collect all these build points and be able to. Um, let's go ahead and tell you to collect this. And you can be the one that captures it as well. Come on, you take it out. There we go. I think we're alright. Let's bring you back. So you're taking a little bit of damage from these turrets, I have to, have to say. I think for the most part we're alright though. Let's put a turret on here. Let's recycle this turret. It was fairly helpful, but not hugely helpful. Having two hearts, turrets here means we can just completely annihilate everything that's coming out of here by three different turrets firing at it. So, I'm, not, I'm honestly not too worried. I could put another turret down, but it's just no point. At this point, we've completely, utterly destroyed them. It looks like there's some sort of... just the healing there. Engineer, maybe. Sniper. Uh, minigun. And flame, I'm guessing. So we'll be introduced to these units as we go on. Uh, it's actually a really satisfying, a really fun game. Um, you have to just have to be very careful of what you pick. So I actually managed to completely miss these turrets. Let's go ahead and assault them. Just get rid of them. that medic gun doesn't actually do anything to them even though it's got a bit of a longer range. Oh hello. I made the mistake of leaving that open just for like a second. And <laughs> it, it did the typical thing of yeah let's screw him over. <laughs> but uh, luckily I think um, when the hives spawn in like that they have a very small amount of health to begin with. So now I think that's, that's mission victory to us. There we go. Thank you very much for watching and uh yeah, this has been um, a very, very fun time. <laughs> um, I can't recommend this game enough. It's bro it's very worth getting. Um, you do have that Starship Troopers feel. It's fun. It's simple. Uh, I'll probably fuck up for up another video when I've played on a few more missions and I've got, you know, unlocked all the units, etc., etc. Um, you can see the uh, kill count here. I mean, the aliens, 12,000 aliens and that. I have played missions where there's been like 20,000 killed. It's huge numbers. But yeah, thanks very much for watching, and I shall see you again next time.